hi and welcome back today in this video let's talk about some of the amazing products that is made in india these are some of the products by indian brands which i love um and i have been using for a really long time um i have makeup hair care skin care so yeah let's get started with the video let's start with some skin care and one moisturizer i've been using only religiously and it is by dot and key this is the dot and keys um vitamin c and e super bright moisturizer i've actually used this last year also um during the summer time only and this is such a nice summer time moisturizer it's a gel moisturizer this is the texture and it is is how it is literally like summer in a jar what i love about this is the texture it's gel like so it will not make your skin really oily or greasy if you have oily skin you are going to love this i like to use this only during the summers though on winters it does not provide that much of hydration but for the summers it's the perfect amount is a nice a little bit of a subtle glow like a very citrus fragrance um no, i like uh, my skin care to have no fragrance and i feel dotton keys now they have started doing fragrance free but before they had i think one of the main turn offs in their skin care was their skin care was highly fragrant So just a heads up um but once you put it into your skin the uh, smell the fragrance doesn't li really linger so i don't mind it but i love it for the formulation the texture if you're looking for a nice summer time moisturizer this is really good um another thing that i have to mention one of the best sunscreens indian sunscreens that i've used is by rotten key again this is the vitamin e so same range um super bright sunscreen this was launched like way later than this but it's from the same range and i've been using this combo and it's just so good if you're an oily skin person if you're an oily combination in type this combination is heaven for you one moisturizer this one uh which is a ceramides and hyaluronic acid one um this is great if you have dry skin um so this is something that i use maybe mostly during the night time and more suitable for the winters so for now i have switched to this but i love this equally really really good moisturizer and this is fragrance free also. i have to give it to dotton key um i really like dotton key skin care i also have a face wash from them i have a writer this is this one <clears throat> i'm talking about this one this is the dotton keys um watermelon super glow facial gel cleanser this is again a create cleanser is a gel cleanser but when you lather it it becomes really resembles like a creamy consistency um and the packaging bro like look at the colors it's so eye pleasing something that you would really want to buy so i love the packaging as well very very gen z and all of that next product is from orthrhythm i will have to say that i have a lot of skin care products mostly because mostly mainly because i feel like with skin care our indian brands have like killed it killed it i will have to say that in makeup can do better but with skin care honestly they have killed it in the last few years I, this one this is the lip butter by earth rhythm i love the packaging it's so cute it has this golden sort of packaging it's very cute and tiny fits in your purse now the formulation of this is pretty thick melts into your lips like butter extremely hydrating it's fragrance free i think this works really nice as an overnight treatment sort of or you can also use this during the day time of course but i've been loving this i have i mostly use this during my during the night time before i go to sleep so it's such a beautiful um beautiful lip treatment yeah it says intensive hydrating treatment which i agree if you're looking for a nice good affordable lip treatment sort of i think this is going to be great um i have one more sunscreen which is by dr sheds it's their dr sheds vitamin c and ceramide sunscreen they have launched quite a few variants but this one is by far my favorite this is also the first one that i tried this for me is like a moisturizer and sunscreen both for my dry skin so when i use this i don't feel the need to use a moisturizer like in the summers right now it has 1% ceramide complex 2% vitamin c 1% hyaluronic acid it has mineral and organic filters i have a full on video for this one i'm going to link it for you in the i button if you're interested very creamy consistency gives a nice glow moisturize hydrate of course gives you this gives you the sun protection some of you may not like this i've seen that they do not like dr shet sunscreen but for me i have like this personally i like this more than the haldi and hyaluronic acid one last year this is all that i have used and i have finished quite a bit of it okay for a change i have a perfume now this is other uh, rene's bloom 
and this is like almost like a sample size 10 ml and you get this on amazon i got this for under 200 i think 150 or 200 rupees and this fragrance is something that very surprisingly took me away fragrance is that it's so cheap it's so inexpensive but the fragrance is inexpensive but the fragrance is like so expensive expensive um it has almond it has um a little bit of floral notes like tuberose and it also has vanilla tonka and cocoa so i would describe this as a creamy floral fragrance it's not that nauseating or a floral fragrance at all it has a nice creamy touch to it a little bit vanilla -y also get this i am sure you're not gonna regret it come back to skincare i still have quite a few skincare products this is by minimalist indian in me had to do this i have used the crap out of this minimalist marula oil 0.5 percent moisturized with hyaluronic acid vitamin f vitamin e nourishment hydration but this is specifically for dry to normal skin i don't use this in the summers at all because it's very 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 um as it is an oil based moisturizer it's very 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 extremely hydrating to a point it might look greasy if you apply it a lot so i use this only in a pm routine it's a staple for me period like i'm gonna buy this again during the winters all-time favorite um, i might have mentioned this in my videos previously the perfect pm routine mala moisturizer for me intensely hydrates i love slapping this on and sleeping with a very greasy face that's just how i like it let's do a little bit of makeup also this brand fay beauty i feel like this brand is very like on those minimal aesthetic clean girl uh non-makeup wearers kind of brand that's how i see it because it's very very minimal um and these are the two products i love almost all the products that i use from them i love their sunscreen their spf juice you know i love the brush the combo i think i've shown that in my favorites video i feel like their lip products are quite underrated um uh, the first one that i have is a matte lipstick um i used to really love their buildable mattes but that is discontinued so this is their modern matte lipstick gold imprints that they have it is like a holographic thing it has a magnetic closure and this is the shade eccentric it's a nice pink it's a nice very everyday kind of pink it's super pigmented so comfortable on the lips love the formula of these lips some amazing shades like the shades that they that they come out with it's so unique this is my old love um i stopped using in the middle but i have continuously in the past this is their gloss gloss first look at the packaging have you seen something like this i don't think so any shades available the one that i have is sizzling and it though it looks like a cherry red but when you apply it into your lips it is like a very subtle sheer red tinge it smells also like cherries for some reason a roller ball kind of a packaging you just click it from here i don't click too much but formulation is something that i really like it's i feel like this is like lip gloss plus a lip oil for me once this wears off your lips are going to be so hydrated and moisturized i'm sure this has really good ingredients which is why every time i use this my lips feel so nourished so moisturized love love i have one hair care product for you my recent favorite this is by nika naturals it's apple cider vinegar and ginger shampoo I like the fragrance of this it's so soft and pleasant and nice very girly this shampoo lathers really well um i use this when i have scalp become has become really oily and it has a lot and it has kind of that build up i use this because this will make your scalp squeaky clean not a shampoo that's very hydrating i will say that but it makes my hair so soft i wasn't expecting that from nika but it's really really good it's really affordable also but blush by swiss beauty is their very recent one their craze collection one this is the lip and cheek mac room look at the packaging tower 28 vibes the shade that i have is brown by i've used this on my skin today it's supremely pigmented this is such a good blush it does not have that very dewy finish of course if you use a glowy hydrating products underneath this will seem dewy on your skin i will give it to this is that the packaging if this blush came in a regular pot packaging i will not buy it like that's just how it works now you know if you don't have pretty packaging i don't think anybody will be interested so that was very smart of them another very favorite of mine um the sugandha's cleansing 
squalene cleansing oil this, i've said this before i'm gonna still say it one of the best cleansing oils slash makeup removers i have ever used but with this product a lot a little goes a long long way it is so gentle on the skin um most of the cleansers like makeup cleansers i've used like burns my eyes if it gets into my eyes accidentally but this one i can rub my eyes with it and it's still yet it removes our makeup so effectively beautifully it just melts my makeup no matter how heavy makeup i have light makeup i have this is it uh, removes any kind of mascara does not leave like oily film on your skin so you do not have to worry about that it's fragrance free it's gentle it's effective one of the best one of the best um comes for 500 which i think is pretty good for a cleansing oils because i've seen cleansing oils can be a little bit pricey so one last skincare product this is by kiro it's their face serum this was sent to me but i've used this religiously for like two to three months i've used this religiously this is their 10% vitamin C serum. Um, I think vitamin C is a really versatile ingredient and also very in right now. Any skin type can use this. 99% purity of vitamin C, which is great. Now, if you have a skin type um, which is uneven, okay, and you want something to help with it, um, not change it. Help with it and something you want that glow, that skincare glow, vitamin C is for you. Like I have used more than half of it and like this much is left now. I don't like to use like a lot of skincare products all at once. So I've used this for a while now. I'm using the snail mucins. So I don't like to layer a lot of skincare products um, because sometimes it just spills on my skin. It's just skincare or anything like makeup. Less is more for me. I feel this is very gentle on your skin but it's also very effective. You know, I have tried a lot of makeup products from Kiro. But if I had to recommend you just that one product it has to be their lipsticks the formulation is to die for um they are a little bit expensive but on amazon there is always some sort of discount and you can get it for around four five hundred like it has a moosey kind of a texture the formulation um it's so comfortable it's so good they have some groundbreaking nude shades for indian skin they are so freaking good i have so many shades but these two are my favorite nutmeg nude which is like a classic which is like the best seller from them such a beautiful brown nude and these lipsticks also last you a very very long time so the other shade is nude ginger this is from their newest collection um this one has more hints of pink in it as much as i love the liquid lipsticks you know i'm like a gloss girl so this one this is the lip lacquer is the shade roasted walnut i love this mostly for the shade but also the formulation is non-sticky it's pigmented it's shiny it's beautiful it's hydrating it's like a cool tone brownish shade that has like bits of hint of mauve in it you know my taste so this is just that and like one of my favorite all-time favorite lip product that was the last product with that we end today's video uh if you want to check out any of these products um everything that i've spoken about will be in the description box for you thank you so much for watching this video i love you a lot and i'll see you in my next video bye